Welcome to Upstream, one of Shell's three strategic pillars. I'm Wild, the Upstream Director. And I'm Zoe, Executive Vice President, Conventional Oil & Gas here at Shell. The Upstream business plays a critical role in delivering the oil and gas needed to meet society's ever-growing demand for energy, enhancing prosperity and living standards across the world. Our people possess the passion and the capability that have allowed us for decades to make Shell a partner of choice. Today, as the world's energy system changes, society expects energy companies to lead the transition and upstream will play a fundamental role in supporting Shell's ambitious transformation. Upstream's robust cash flow is crucial to support Shell in delivering meaningful dividends to shareholders and investing in lower carbon energy while responsibly providing the energy that the world needs. To achieve this, Upstream must become more focused, more competitive, and more resilient. And as we continue to invest in our upstream business, we will be selective and disciplined in our investment choices. We know we have more work to do to unleash the full potential of our upstream business. Yet in recent years, we've shown we've got the discipline and determination to do what it takes to improve our business, to make our operations fitter and leaner. In the last five years alone, we've reduced unit development costs by around 50%, reduced unit operating costs by more than 25% and managed to increase our unit cash flow from operations by almost 70%. These are significant achievements that we are really proud of. And of course, they're only possible through the commitment of our incredible teams and people. It's our people who will implement Upstream's new strategy. So here are just a few of them to explain how our portfolio and our business will transform. First up, over to Amanda in The Hague. Thanks, Zoe. Exciting times. Upstream never stands still, and to meet the challenge of transformation, we will focus our portfolio to nine core positions. In the Gulf of Mexico, Permian, Brazil, UK North Sea, Nigeria, Kazakhstan, Oman, Malaysia, and Brunei. These positions currently generate more than 80% of Upstream's operating cash flow and offer room for growth with strong integrated value chains through our integrated gas and trading businesses. In the future, they will attract roughly 80% of Upstream's capital expenditure and a majority of Upstream's human and technical resources. The rest of our portfolio will be managed on a leaner operating model to focus on short to medium term value delivery. Simply put, these assets will either become core positions be managed for cash or divested. We will also focus our exploration spend and portfolio. By 2025, we will de-risk our existing frontier position and do not expect any new frontier exploration thereafter. Back to you, YL. We will focus our investments on these nine core positions to support the material cash flow we expect to generate from upstream well into the 2030s. We also see opportunities to make changes in our organization and the way we work, to improve cycle times and deliver better returns while reducing CO2 emissions. Mohamed, over to you. Thanks, Wael. We are building a leaner, more agile organization with simplified accountability and less complex projects that allow us to recoup investment more quickly. We will standardize and replicate project design to improve our break-even price and unit cost reductions. As we've done in the Gulf of Mexico, where nearly 80% of the Vito Deepwater platform design has been replicated in our well development. We will also focus on our differentiated capabilities, including unique subsurface data, tools, and expertise. And we will be more disciplined in using the external market for specialized skills and technologies when it's more efficient. Finally, a range of digital technologies will be at the heart of Upstream's transformation. They will leverage decades of data, changing the way we work and enhancing our performance. This will make our Upstream business a more competitive, resilient, and a rewarding place to work. Upstream aspires to responsibly deliver the energy the world needs today while making our business a compelling investment case. To be a responsible operator means continuing to power economic progress through the products we offer, 
while protecting the environment and ensuring efficient use of natural resources. It also means continuing to raise standards in safety, ethics and transparency, while rebuilding trust where we could have done things better. Finally, it means providing lower carbon products to our customers and the world. Leah, over to you. I'm excited by Shell's climate ambition, announcing that we aim to become a net zero emissions energy business by 2050 or sooner in step with society is something that I'm very proud of. However, our current business plans won't get us there, so we need to change. This means three things for Upstream. First, reducing the emissions from our operations and from the energy we use, which will involve eliminating routine flaring by 2030 and reducing methane emissions further. Next, reducing the carbon intensity of our portfolio. Since 2016, we have reduced the total emissions of our portfolio, operated and non-operated, by about 20%. Finally, developing carbon capture and storage projects for our own assets and to help other shell businesses build lower carbon energy solutions for our customers. The upstream business will deliver the energy of today while funding the energy of tomorrow. We have a compelling investment case built on a strategy that will result in a more focused, more competitive and more resilient business. As one of Shell's strategic pillars, Upstream will play a fundamental role in supporting Shell's success for years to come.